<laughs> I'd like to welcome you all to the month of spooks and scares. Welcome to October, where the feeling of things are changing. You feel that cool breeze against your neck? Is it just a simple autumn breeze or the kiss of death? I'd like to welcome you all to Song of Horror. If you haven't noticed, it is October, and I've been holding off playing a lot of horror games lately. I've been extremely excited to play horror games. And you know what? I think this month's gonna be something special. Not only am I finally playing horror games, because I honestly have a couple that I really want to play. But... Well, I'm also not the best at horror games. What I'm going to say is, jump scares are cheap, but they'll always, for the most part, get me. And this game itself has interested me in a long time. For a long time. And, because I do not have the best commentary, we all know that. Um, oh, really, you're doing that to me? One second, you all know what I need to do. Hello. It is I. If you've seen Final Fantasy XIV a couple times, you've seen my face three times? Three times or twice? First things first, before we get started, let me just check to make sure all the sayings are good. Probably turn the music down a bit, just a bit. Difficulty? The E.T. Hoffman mode is equivalent in difficulty to MR James, with one caveat. When you lose a character, you can choose to load the last checkpoint. Permadeath is an integral part of Song of Horror experience. Before choosing ETA Hoffman, it is recommended to have already tried Edgar Allan Poe or MR James before finishing the game on this difficulty. Will not have unlocked HP Lovecraft. So, something we should know. By the way, I cannot select HP Lovecraft. Maybe another year, maybe another time. Something we need to- oh my god, the graphics, why? No, 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 I will not stand for this. No, 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 no. So, you know what? I want you, and... No, I'm not gonna do that. Okay, so, something about this game. No, 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 no. Font size, we'll do medium. I'm sorry, I'm trying to do settings as well as possible before we actually jump into this. And by the way, uh, wait, uh, oh, darn. Yes, I do. All right, I'm restarting the game real quick. I'll be back. And look at that, we're back. All the settings should be good. So at the moment, choose game. What's that? Oh, load, okay. Episodes can't select, good. But yeah, as you can see, there are four difficulties I can't play on one. So what I was about to say is, uh... What was I about to say? Oh yeah, I've been wanting to play horror games for a while. I'm gonna be doing an entire month. Now you can recommend some, but uh, for the most part, I'm gonna be starting a week at a time to get one week in, because I am going to try and learn, not learn, get the feeling of what I'm doing here. And, oh boy. I have an idea for two games, and I'll let you know what I'm gonna end on. End of October is going to be Amnesia the Dark Descent. I haven't played that one in a long time. I can't wait. But this month I want to start with Song of Horror. A game I've had in my, my, in my Steam library for two years now. I have yet to play it. Let's jump into it. A new game. And if I need to, I shall move the camera. Oh yeah, that's what I was going to say. Uh, if you wonder why I look down all the time, like right there. I got a small little mini tablet like screen right down there. My webcam and main screen is there, but down there I have a small screen where I see OBS and all that, and my little face and all that. But that's why if I will, I'm looking down, I'm looking down at that. Now, let's have a new game. This has gone long enough. My little Adria? Doesn't seem like a normal music box. Oh, 
Oh, you want me to use a controller? Well, luckily I got one right here. Hopefully it immediately goes. Alright, we'll see. <laughs> Daniel's apartment. Got a little hand clip in the neck right there. Home sweet home. Okay, yep, controller works immediately. Excellent. Give me a second. It's Friday and I just got home. I don't feel like going anywhere. My old flashlight saved me more than once in the great outdoors. Oh, let's look at everything. Because everything could mean something. Those bring back some good memories. Oh, I can just turn off my lights. I'm going to do that. And at the moment it is 7 11. Okay. It's important. Okay, this room looks important. I'm going to leave it at the moment. Also, I know that it's a little jarring to see a black little screen around uh, the game. I could shrink it a bit more. Let me actually try that. Can I shrink my webcam a little more? I can. I'll shrink myself about right there. Yeah, we'll see how that goes. I'll have to watch it and replay. I don't want it too big where it's taking up too much screen, but I don't want too small where you can see me. All right, let's go in here. Nope. Oh, crikey. Seriously? Damn it. All right, I walked into the room. Hello. Daniel, it's me again. Hey, we've got a bit of a major emergency going on here. Oh, you're joking. Friday evening, and there's an emergency? This is serious business. Sebastian Husher is nowhere to be found, and his manuscript should have been at the office by Tuesday. He won't answer his calls, and he hasn't shown up at his office at the university. He's vanished into thin air. Oh, don't screw with me, Etienne. Call him on Monday or send a courier for him. I, I just got in the door less than five minutes ago. I go myself, but I've got to attend Albert's performance in half an hour. Plus, Husher's house is closer to your place than it is to mine. Come on, man. The sooner you go, the sooner you'll get back home. You're going to owe me a big fat favor. Whatever you want. Write this down. For Abbott Thomas Road. In the old housing developments along Highway EB-15. EB-15? Good God, that's out in the sticks. I plan to take a few days off after this. Well, we'll talk about that once you find him. Oh, and if he gives you the manuscript, don't show it to anyone. And don't go selling it off to the highest bidder. I'll see what I can do. We'll ring you up when I get back. Yeah, Thanks, let's Dad. hope to look at the You're apartment more. Well, that's what I get for not exploring. Again. Another Friday evening and I'm working as an errand boy. I suppose they're too important over at Wake Publishers to come looking for jolly old Husher themselves. Shit. Even I should be too important for that. Though I mustn't overstretch my complaints. Rising from my lot as a drunkard and financial ruin to that of an errand boy is actually quite an improvement. If only things had gone a bit better for the company. Or I'd got on the wagon a bit sooner. Damn, Sophie did the right thing when she divorced me. I would have divorced myself in her place. Daniel Neuer, the bloody alcoholic. Chin up, you. That is Daniel Neuer, the bloody ex-alcoholic, after all. Wake Publishers employee by day, Wake Publishers screwed over lackey by evening. Even Friday evenings. But if I could find Husha, I have a feeling my status at the company would rise quite a bit. After all, he is the publishing firm's biggest star. Let's cross our fingers and hope he's home. Got a feeling he's not. Oof, this is gonna bad for me. I know nothing about this game. The Husher Mansion is home to writer Sebastian P. Husher, his wife Catherine, their two children, Julia and Saul, and their housekeeper. I read as fast as I possibly could. With no urgency.
I'm just not going to the house. I got a feeling bad things are in there. Doors open. That's always a good sign. Prelude. A Friday like any other. Oh, great. So, something about this game is, um... You are chased... Oh, look at it. Move my head. I know you're chased by a great evil. There's no beating it. And when a character dies, and as you... You know, when I read the description of the difficulties, they are permanently dead. And their story for this game is over. I'm probably going to get a lot of them killed. Don't get too attached. Hmm. A tricycle. I didn't know Husher had kids. Front door is open. We just saw that. So let's go over here. Why take the side door when I can take the main one right there? I don't. I can't run or anything yet. Can only do that. There's a cat to the left. Like I only heard it and it can't see it. A newspaper. That murder that murderer they arrested about a week ago is on the front page. There was a murder, eh? I don't think we should go in the house. I'm saying Hello. this now. Is that music? I'd better take a look. How about we don't? Oh, a light source. Each character has their own light source. To turn it off or on, press right trigger and... Okay. Once it's on, you can choose the direction which light you want to point to do so with the right joystick. This will allow you to illuminate specific areas and also help you interact with objects that might not be in front of your character. Your light source will never run out. Use it as much as you need. Is that I, someone playing a music box? I got a feeling HP Lovecraft mode light source might be more limited. Hmm. They look like travel guides. The clock marks the clock mark marks twelve. Guess it needs fixing. Hmm. There's a lot of clothes. Is there anyone home? The alarm seems disabled. Much better if it goes off. Much better if it goes off. I'll have a lot of explaining to do. I'm not going towards the music box yet because I know for fact this is called Song of Horror. And going there is not going to be good. Much better since I stopped drinking. Maybe I could ask Sophie out. Focus, Daniel. Woo. Okay, and turning it off, okay. Or that button. Okay, right trigger and pushing in on the right joystick will turn off and on the flashlight. All right, right now I'm gonna turn it off because I absolutely do not need it. No, that's not where the music's coming from. I don't want to go where the music's coming from. Those paintings are depressing. I've never put them in my place. Ushers in a lot of these framed pictures. The family, I guess. Oh, right there. Oh, that's weird. What are all these suitcases doing here? It sounds like the music's coming from here. Me, at least. Yeah. Yeah, I was right, because it's now over in there. Books and plates at the same cabinet. Not much order here. Family portraits, I guess. The gold. Man, that mirror's dirty. The table is set, but covered in dust. Where is everybody? There's something on that doorknob. I don't want to open it yet. Let's keep looking. Decorative fruit. The expensive porcelain kind. I guess they don't want anyone thinking they're poor. Alright, let's see. Documents and items. You have found an ex uh, example item. Expect it to gain information by pressing A. To examine the back side, use the right joystick. You can access your inventory and, cl uh, and collected item documents at any time by pressing... Oh, okay. All right. 
Freed. Dear Sebastian, how are you? To be completely honest, I must admit that we are all impatiently awaiting your latest work. My dear friend, I must ask you a favor. Enclosed with this letter, you'll find one of the latest items we have purchased at the store. An ornate music box with fascinating engravings. The craftsmanship is astonishing, but something else has caught my eye. Or perhaps I should say ear. The melody, Sebastian. It's peculiar. You have to listen to it for yourself. I've never heard this song before. My attempts at finding the score, or the name of the composer, failed. I can't for the life of me get the melody out of my head. First letter from Isaac Fabar. A letter for, for Usher found by Daniel. Okay. Would you be willing to help me find any clues regarding this box and its mysterious melody? I would be forever grateful. With the warmest of wishes, Isaac Fabar. Yes, I've also enclosed the little information I managed to find about said box. Letter addressed to Sebastian P. Usher. Okay. Interesting. We're not going in there. We all know I'm not going. Well, do you think there's anything else worth looking at in the house at the moment? Well, let's keep. Yeah, let's keep looking. It's a record player. Nice record player. Looks vintage. <laughs> what a beauty. Sound like an angel. Also, he's making noises. It's making me uncomfortable. Look at those bottles. I think they almost ruined my life. Hmm. Nothing. Oh, wait. History and art magazines. I've got nothing against them, but they bore me to death. Alright. The deer head is almost as big as I am. Mm -hmm. All these books are written by Husher. It must be first editions. Hmm. With so many people in the house, it's no wonder no one has... It's no wonder no one ever answered Etienne's call, sorry. I forgot how they pronounced his name immediately. Oh, this must be the study. The library. History fiction. Fun to read, although I prefer the newspaper. A camera. Or rather, a fake camera. Got feeling that's going to come in useful later. I won't remember that. If I break that, my grandsons will finish paying it off. Hmm? I wonder who this is. A respectable amount of books. This is like the library then. Okay. I can now see why they said mouse is preferred because I don't think mouse and keyboard for this it'd be a bit weird walking around. Yeah. I, I'm glad I'm doing keep uh, controller. Man, this guy's even messier than I am. Hmm. Mostly noir and police thrillers. Now these I like. Actually, I do like noirs and police thrillers. I'd read those too. Grammar and reference books. I guess these come in handy when Usher's writing. Books, books, and more books. Japanese swords. Anything from that country is popular now thanks to those stupid cartoons. Those animoi. Looks like this drawer's jammed shut. In other words, I'll be opening that later. Maybe. Alright, I guess it's time to get moving and finding the music box. There's no sprint or anything yet. I, I can only imagine one's coming soon, though. The haunting melody grows closer and closer. Yeah, no, it's actually impossible to have a door there. One second. There's a classical musical... Uh, um, it's a classical music album on the record player. The music's like... Yeah, music's telling me stuff. There's stuff lying all over the place. It reminds me of my college dorm. This radio is to be older than me. And 
Are those rifle re real? Alright, give me a second. Wow, this guy likes to hunt Sophie a bit if she saw this. I don't want to go in there. I got to. Ooh, that got loud. Don't let the door close. Oh, well, that's not good. I'd hardly taken a step forward when I heard the door close behind me. When I turned around, the door wasn't there anymore. And all that was left of it was a strange shadow on the wall. I searched. I despaired. And I screamed until my throat began to burn. The candles started to run out, as did the batteries in my torch. From within the most suffocating darkness, the hours went by until turning into days. And I began to fall in and out of a restless sleep. I would hear voices, sometimes right next to me, other times a few yards away. It seemed like they were coming from the other side of the wall. Desperate cries, howling in horror, and sometimes, the worst of all, a vast, oppressive silence would fall, seeming to emanate from everywhere and nowhere all at once. There was nobody there, just hallucinations, nightmares, black nothingness, and the song from that music box. Trapped in this impossible place, I wondered if I was going to die there. Well, that was a quick tutorial character. Are we going to have to break out of the house with him? Or... Three days later. Etienne, do you have any news on Daniel yet? Oh, Sophie. No. We've been calling him at home all day, but there's no response. Do you know if he's got a mobile phone? No, I don't think so. And if he does, he doesn't tend to keep it on him. Oh, man. I think I should pass by the Husher place when I leave, just to see if they know anything. Husher the writer? Your client? Yeah. I sent Daniel over there on Friday, and I haven't heard from him since. What's the address? I'm going to stop by Daniel's place, and if I don't find him, I can go around and ask about him. The house on the outskirts of town, on Highway EB-15. Number four, Abbott Thomas Road. It's a big house. Okay, I'm headed over. Call me if you find him. Uh, of course, same to you. I get new character. So is he dead? Hmm. Oh. Oh. We got characters. Okay. We'll start by reading some of these. <laughs> Sophia Van Denet. Age 40, light source, candle. Life has, life has put Sophie to the test many times, but she has always pulled, pulls through. It was thanks to this resilience that she summoned the strength to put an end to her failing marriage with Daniel. Sophie, who runs a well-known art gallery, is now enjoying the ever-elusive prosperity she has always longed for. We have stats in this game. She has 5 speed, 5 stealth, but 4 strength, and then 6 serenity. She has scented candles. Whenever I light one, everything around me feels much safer and more peaceful. Alright. Interesting. At 10 Bernard, age 45, light resource lighter. Well, he's a smoker, so we can easily see he uses a lighter. A teen, a 10, a confident self-made man in sales management at Wake Publishing makes his, makes, making him Daniel's direct supervisor. In his role as personal assistant, Daniel has become somewhat of an errand boy. 
but Atin is slowly giving him greater responsibilities. Although they love to complain about working together, they have grown fond of each other, developing a friendship outside of work that neither of them like to omit. His speed is a 5, which shocks me because he's a smoker. His stealth, though, is a 4. His strength is a 6. His serenity is also a 5. Note folder. Writing down any anything important. Secret to remembering. Alexander Laskin. So now we're getting into the characters I haven't even seen yet. Age 59. Light source candle. Alexander and his wife, Marsha, are house. Oh, they're housekeepers. Okay. Housekeepers at Writer Sebastian P. Husher's mansion. Watching over the author's children is one of the many household duties. The Russian couple of a Christian faith moved to Europe in the early 80s and attempt to flee from a mysterious past that Alexander rarely, if ever, speaks about. Oh, jeez. He has four spear speed, but he has two, four speed, six strength. Holy cow, he has... No, sorry. He has four speed, six stealth, eight strength, only two serenity. Mental hip flask. Take a good swig from the flask to soothe, soothe your nerves when danger lurks. Always worked for me. Alina Ramos, age 32, light source flashlight. Alina is a passionate hands down type of learner, always eager to give her hands dirty at work. Be energetic, she traveled the world with her sister in search for a better life for them both. Now working as an electrical technician at Monolith Security, Elena is part of a highly qualified tech team preparing high-end home security systems for exclusive clients. And it makes sense because the home security at his mansion was off or damaged. Her speed is 8, stealth is 8, strength is 5, serenity is 3. It doesn't work very well. Picks up a lot of weird interference. Elena. Silent Hillish? Alright. Hmm. Interesting. Damn, who am I gonna feel the... You know what? We'll go with him. We'll go with the man who set him here. Now what awaits me? September 20th, 1998. Well, now I know the year. Probably said the year earlier, but I wasn't paying attention. We're fine. Give me a second, no documents. And I got a candle, a, a lighter. A tricycle, must be long to Usher's little boy. All right. Is the door still going to be open? Because I... Oh, oops. Sorry, that was me. Oh. Oh. Okay. So if you turn the lighter off, it, you have to really... There we go. This newspaper is about one or two weeks old. It looks like it even rained on it. Alright. One. The Husher mansion let's not get Why this is the front door open let's not get him killed bunch of books travel guides okay all this is useless let's continue no I want to look at that looks like it yep it's deactivated right. it's just another bathroom mm. Amanda's right. I look good in my trench coat. <laughs> nice. Alright. Uh, here's the thing, though. If I get everyone killed way too fast, I will redo the game. I want the last more than one episode. Alright. What's that? I wonder if that suitcase belongs to a guest. I 
don't know where I am right now. This bicycle's pretty old. Must belong to Husher or his wife, Catherine. Nice ride. I wouldn't mind having one, one of that. Oh, we got something. A metal box. I was like, there's something in it. Uses. Oh, oh it's screwed shut. Why would you screw it? Right. Uh, full tools except ev everything except a flathead screwdrivers. Not gonna happen. The water heater. There's not much I can do with no electricity in the house. Boiler functioning. Oh, that's kind of useless at the moment. We'll get there when we get there. But yeah, if everyone dies in my playthrough, I'll just get to restart because I want them to last as possible. I want to try and beat the game too. I do. I'm going to move this just a little closer to my face. There we go. Just ignore it. Alright. My dear eccentric husband, I left your key in the top drawer of your bureau in the library. The children have been very nervous lately. We need to talk about this soon as you get back. I don't want them playing with it. They're talking about the music box, aren't they? Those things give me a chill. My nightmare inspired them. Alright, let's just go right to it. I don't like the sounds of that. Hey, wasn't Husher's wife a semi-famous chess player? I think he mentioned it one day. Okay. I know where I have to go. I just don't think I have the strength to go there. It won't open without a key. Oh, right. Oh, wait. I think I can easily crawl in. Why? Why would you think that? I don't want you to think that. We know where that is. It's the one with the drawer, right? So it'll be here. Sides of one, get my hands on this key. Now I gotta find oil. Mm -hmm. These swords remind me of the cartoons my son's my son watches. Buster was here, Sam. Oh, okay. I see a bunch of grammar or language books. This must be a section for B for boring. I agree. These looks these look like the kind of books that don't let me sleep at night. So this is where Husher does his magic. It all seems so vintage. Oh, I hate the creaking in the house. I'm saying that now. This globe must be really old. Husher's personal library. I wonder if it's like... I wonder what it's like to live in the mind of a man like him. I don't know, but I don't like it at the moment. House is creaking in a lot of ways. The fireplace is empty. I could light if I had some wood. 
Okay. So here's my other problem. I'm very bad with horror games. So if you see me avert my eyes, it's because I'm being a wimp on purpose. Unless I'm looking down there, then I'm looking at the screen of my OBS. This poor plant is almost dead. But yeah, I am not the best with horror games. One fun fact is when I was... When Silent Hill 3 first came out, uh, that beginning carnival area gave me nightmares for a week, and all I did was play those first 10 minutes if you run through that place. Oh, I've never had nightmares before. Well, there's a specific one too I had. That's a different story for a different time. If I play a horror game with a clown, I'll explain it. It's actually quite funny now. Ooh, what's that? Matches. Matchbox. Just an ordinary matchbox. Uh, there's still quite a few left. Okay. Everything's nice and neat. Dusty, didn't Husher have a housekeeper? I could play the husband of that housekeeper. I got a feeling I don't have... There's something on the counter. We'll get there when we get there. Uh, this is disturbing. Stall seven, a drawing by done by Husher's youngest child, and it's a very disturbing drawing. Drawings notes magnets and good good grades. This the usual for family household with kids. I wouldn't mind having one of those app these apples if I knew how old they were. Right now is going on 11:10 in the game. I can't say I'm surprised to see these books in the kitchen. At least they seem to be cooking. Mm -mm. A metal ring. Huh. A bottom half of a key. Oh. Wait, it looks like it was broken right here. So it's a key. The gas stove is pretty ancient and covered in dust. What's with that puddle? Look, a loose wire. Back up immediately. I do not want to touch that. Alright. Let's walk around that. That's a danger. We're gonna go in here. Never mind. We're going in here. I know there's more mechanics to this game. When they're gonna teach makes... Oof. Legumes, canned food, healthier than stuff I used to eat when I was young. Weird, they keep cans of dog food, but I haven't seen one anywhere. Mm -hmm. Oil can. Mm. Oh, I need this. Good. When's everything gonna just fall apart on me? What's that noise? You better take a look before you go back out. Press your ear against the door, walk up to it, and when you see the listen icon, press and hold Y. While you're listening, pay attention to the sounds that come from the other side. I need to check out what that noise was. Um, camera broke. Sorry. There we go. Using your map, it seems like the coast is clear. From now on, you can listen on what's happening at the other side of unexamined doors. Sometimes you might have the chance. To, sometimes you might have the chance to do in the other doors as well. Pay attention to the icons when you're near one. Using your map to find your way around, it records every single place you've explored so far. To open it, press on the left joystick. The map will constantly update with relevant information. Don't forget to check it out once in a while. Okay. He said it's good to go out. We're going out. I 
I don't have the icon, so it must be safe to go out. Okay. I kid you not, I am a wimp with horror games. Doesn't have the icon. God, I am. Come on, mate, we got this. No listen icon. Doesn't help while my lights are off, too. Put the camera light, which is in my face. Damn drawer stuck. Okay. Use the oil can. Right, it's not to inspect. There we go. Okay. Worked like a charm. Now you got the master key. Looks like an old key. It was jammed. It was jammed in the drawer in the library. Hmm. Hushur has a folder full of papers. I wonder what's inside. You can open the drawer and find out. The noises this place makes. Alright, real quick. We're going back to the dining room and using the key, so basically dead ahead. It can move. Who could be calling? Hello? Who is this? I can't understand a thing. What is this? We can't leave my room. How the... What in the hell? Sounded like a child. Was that Husher's son? Might be. He had two sons and we haven't seen them. Oh, I went out the wrong way. Well, we're going in here. No, listen, Icon. Go. I wish there was a sprint, but there's not. I'll bring the lockbox with me. Oh, there it is. There's a whole bunch of papers and stuff all over this table. The old, the old radio, the rifle. Okay. Alright, let's see what that is, though. Julia and Saul's notes. A scribbled piece of paper from the smoking room in Husher's mansion. Julia. I saw another door yesterday. As I was walking by the dining room, I suddenly heard the music from the daddy's music box. When I went in, I saw the door. I went running to tell mummy, but when I came back, it was gone. She scolded me for making things up. It's not fair. I was telling the truth. There was an old door here, different from the rest. It even had a key in the keyhole. If I see you again, I'll go inside and leave the door open. That way, mummy will believe me. Saul, I saw that weird door, Julia said. The one that wasn't there before. Mummy was very angry, kept yelling at Julia. The door is scary. I will hide the key in the dollhouse, and I will hide the five dolls too. Even if they get mad at me, and I will bring them out when Mummy and Julia forget about the door. One will be hungry, so her friend will feed her dinner for her. Another will read while her mom takes a shower. The ugly one will watch the door so nobody comes in. Okay, so there's five. Daniel, is that you? Okay, 
the door because she can block in. Stunt is trying to get in. Make sure that door does not open. To gather your strength, repeatedly press A. Once you feel strong enough. Alright, wait for Master with strength. This victim but risky. Okay. door being extra careful luckily you made it this time you're safe for now but don't let your guard down whatever that was it could still be lurking in the shadows certain events will give you the chance to put your ear to the door in the rooms you have already visited just remember be extra careful it might save your life what what just happened am i going crazy Oh no, do not open that door. That door is a no-no right now, holy cow. So, we're going upstairs. Give me a second. Nope, wrong button. Those are letters. Oh, okay. Salmon. Needs a flathead. This is a flathead. Combine that with that. Really? Okay. as if someone took down a painting. Ah. An old painting, someone took it down. The label on the back says it's from February 1634. Well, it's not the painting over there, because that one's a round one. Everything looks so quiet out there. I wish I was out there. Jam, so never mind. Black and white photo. An image of Catherine, Hush's wife, and their children, Julia and Saul. Do not look at this photo. I really don't want to look at the photo now. The Golden Bonfire by Sebastian B. P. Husher. This first novel I read. Don't put this thing down. I'm very scared looking at that picture now because the heartbeat. here okay a, a dirty dishcloth mm. it's completely dry but I bell soak up liquids really well okay a pretty dusty mirror a bunch of unopened toiletries this must be the guest bathroom Okay. That don't look right. What the heck is that black thing? My heart beats beating, so I'm gonna walk away from it. Those photographs of figure figurines must be souvenirs. I came from here, right? Oh, damn it, sorry, wrong button. No, I did not come from here. I don't hear anything. No. It's jammed anyways. Uh, God damn it. 
All right, we'll go down here. Oh man, got enough evil looking mass. A remote control, the standard garage door remote control. The buttons seem worn down. Inspect. Hmm. The typical, okay. Does it have, okay. I guess it has batteries. I love that armchair, quality black leather. If I were in danger, I could probably hide underneath the table. Let's not talk about that. Reference book and manuals for seeing on any subject that you can think of. Nice landscapes, although I wouldn't mind a bit more color. Painted 1905. And creepy mess. Where have I seen these masks before? The documentary about South African tribes? Your classical, classic index box for contact information. I've got one in my office, but the wood is not as nice as this one. There's something broken in this keyhole. Can I use this to get out? The metal piece is... Okay, it's no. Um, not you, not you, not you. Alright, none of these. Okay. So that might be the last broken half of the other key I have currently. Alright, there's a door right in front of me. That door is not happening. That door's jammed. Jammed. Did I not try that one in front of the stairs? One second. Oh, I had to... Oh my god. Nothing interesting around here. Elevation plans of the Husher Mansion. With some notes. Erect scaffolding, paint exterior, repair leaks, fix loose tiles, check old pipes. I might be a little too cautious, but... I do not trust whatever that black thing. No. What? Mrs. Husher? <laughs> I need to get in there. I don't trust that mm -hmm. crying. Second letter from Isaac Fabar, a letter for Husher, written on August 10th, 1998. It was sent by the owner of the antique shop. There's no back. Dear Sebastian, I wanted to tell you firsthand that I will be taking some much needed time off, which means that the store will be closed as of tomorrow. I want you to hear it from me rather than read it on the sign of our door. My daughter's currently traveling, and I must confess I can't keep up with our everyday demands on my own, especially since I don't I have been able to sleep well lately. As soon as she's back, we will open for business again. Rest assured, you will be the first to know. I hope you feel better by then. Please give my warmest regards to your family. Sincerely, Isaac Farber. You started this by giving him the music box. You know what's... I want to look at this photo. But it's says don't look at the photo also let's stay out here huh. real tongs hmm, okay happy anniversary What am I doing? I can't do anything about the floodlight until I get some power on. 
Hey, what if I connect that battery to the floodlight? I don't have anything to connect you with, so no. Those plants actually look pretty healthy. Well, they're outside, they're probably getting rain. Oh. Mm -hmm. Some crates of fruit and a bag of something resembling soil. Nothing out here really of interest except the floodlight, but I can't connect it in any way. Back inside the house we go. I hate to say, at this point, if I came here, the door was open and all that, I would have called the police. I wouldn't even went in here. As soon as I saw the front door was open, I'm gone. I stop doing that. It's gonna bite me. Alright, everything... Does the game not pause when you're in this? Right, it's it's locked. One second, master key. that door is a death sentence right now. I have the flathead and I have the box that needs the flathead, but he doesn't want to open it. Look, you can just leave. So simple, my man, just leave. Actually, while we're out here, it's probably safest. Let's see if I can fuse some things together. Okay, use... Let's combine you with you. There we go, we got the fuses. They seem to be old. Okay. Alright, we have to find a fuse box. Now I got it. Why did that creaking noise come from my car? I'm curious, can I go this way? Daniel's car still parked there. What the heck is, where the heck is he? So I can't go any, well, I have the master key. I keep forgetting I have the master key. The door's jammed, never mind. The door's jammed. All right, so we have the outside, uh, the garage. We'll go to the garage. Um, yeah, we'll have to go. Okay, okay. What an evil sounding house, man. Like, do you really want to go in there? Like, after the encounter with the first dark thing, you think, I don't know, don't do this. the garage opener I just remembered wait is that the fuse box or is that the, uh, it's a rack of tools never mind okay Fine. what the hell 
We found the dog. I don't want to open it. Is there no save? Nope. <laughs> oh. Where's the fuse box? Oh. Give me a second. Locked. Living room. Upstairs. There is a. Mm. Alright, we'll go through some of the rooms. There has to be a room that has the fuse box. You think this would, or if there. Eh. Also, yeah, that dog died. 100%. Yeah, th these instructions at the moment are not useful for me. I'm going to jump like a girl arm. Oh, I can feel it. There's gonna be a big one that gets me. We're fine, we're fine, we're fine. Not for that noise. Living room, maybe? No, not the living room. Uh, not the dining room. We tried the kitchen. But it was in that room. Alright. Time for silence. We gotta listen. Was in here originally. Huh? What? Wait, no, I got. Will this kill me? Mm -hmm. No, good. I still have the I do not okay I felt like that might have been a hazard in a way you walk on it get electrocuted you die Master key. Huh. The cupboard is open. I'll keep that in mind just in case. I can get. I can't get through here. There's too much junk in the way. Oh. Oh, damn it. I can get the fireplace lit. Go there to the hallway to the right. I don't want to go back in the dining room now. I take it when you see the uh, eye with a slash through it, you'll have everything there, probably. Got a feeling something's about to happen. I hate it. Alright. Alright, now we're taking. Let's just go straight. Then we're going right. We have matches. Right, for the most part, it should be, yeah, it is fine. There's no listen option. Let's get that lit now. Oh, you're not. 
I'll need some kind of fuel to light it. Suck so bad. Okay, um, I can go. There's nothing in the library, if we know that. I can go upstairs, maybe. Yeah, I can go upstairs. Nope. No, it's dying here. So I'm trying to reach either the kids or the wife at the moment. But if I was anyone in this situation, I would immediately leave. Call the police and therapy. Ah, therapy. Maybe sleeping pills just to go to. No, no, no. Okay, so we've been to that door. Nope, 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 nope. Not that room. Anything but that room. That important? No. This does a water closet. WC, that door has no handle. Keep going. I keep hitting the wrong button and I am sorry. Then there's this room. Shocked I haven't entered this room yet. You might have something I need. Why would anyone have works of art piled on the floor? They're antiques, painted in March 1883 and September 1790. Brushes and paint cans all dried up. Painter in this house used to be. Hmm. Hey, look, there's a ladder up there. Trap door with a hook. Looks like you can stand on. Hmm. Mm -hmm. okay. Uh, wants me to put a step ladder right there, but like there's none in here. Okay, this room is useless. It showed me the attic, but there's nothing in there at the moment for me. Can't do anything with that yet. Go this way. Right, this is the room that had the couple of items in it. nothing here. Also, that is a terrible painting. Do I already have something that could be of use? Uses remote control tongs. No, not that I think of, no. Danger, probably hiding at that table. Princess. The broken key, which I can't get out with anything I have currently. Unless. Not gonna happen. 
I think the ring would actually fit in here. Maybe if I can glue it together. I don't have anything to do with that with the soap glue's a no-go. What I need's downstairs. I am not going in that room where the darkness is knocking. And I'm not looking at that photograph. No. When you read text saying don't look at the photograph on the photograph you're holding, I... It's the door. The door's freaking the character out. What am I missing? Oh, hey, look at that. It's almost one o'clock. Woo. Um. Damn it, wrong button. Okay. Um. Nothing out there. There's. <laughs> open from the other side. It's useless to even do that. I just noticed there's another door here. Yeah, stop doing that. No, I'm very sorry. Um, how about you? Okay. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh, that's it for the key. Okay, so after a key is done being used, you just throw it away. Dear Julia, if you found this note, congratulations, you're one step closer in solving the puzzle I prepared for you. I hope it keeps you entertained while I'm away. I've hidden your favorite doll in the safe and changed the combination. Since you aspire to becoming a detective when you grow up, I think this is a great chance to put your dedu deduction skills to the test. New combinations as follows. Number of our street address, Saul's age, the decade and the year, the canvas hanging upstairs next, right next to the staircase was painted. Good luck, my dear inspector. Hugs and kisses, daddy. Mmm. That's one doll. Some of these wine bottles cost a fortune. Painted in 1945. Helmet coffin. And this painting is now old. Broken appliances and empty cans. Nothing useful. Collection of apparently useless knickknacks. Watch out, I'd rather not risk breaking one of those vases. This must have been emptied, but the, they must have emptied this wardrobe before bringing it down here. I think I could fit inside. Fuses. What's the fuse box? Yikes, it's a bit of a mess. I'd have to change them all. Uh, what am I doing? I don't know what I'm doing. Well, I like the music though at the moment. Uh, we'll put you there. You, no, no, no. I don't think I put them in the right. Who can blame me? What a mess. Okay, so I'm looking at the wires. The green... Give me a second. Is there any red? 
Okay, we're gonna put you there. Then we're gonna put. Doing. There's a clue here somewhere. No. 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 I was hoping something happened, but nothing happened, so so much for that. Um, I'm looking at the colors. Alright, this one's a 10. Let's do that. The one that has the most hook to it... That one has... Four, three. That one has one. That one has three. So we'll make that one a 20. That one has a 15. Colors? Alright, the orange wires are all leading there. Okay, fine. All the green. Now, what's green? Green. You there and you there. I'm trying to do it by color, but it's not working. Let me just adjust my seating real quick. Ooh. Okay. I'm trying to think here. Okay. Power outgoing, power ingoing. What is ingoing? A green, a blue. There has to be... Ooh, it's getting late for me, isn't it? Oh yeah. Well, I'm playing this late. Good. I'm gonna have some coffee while I'm thinking about this. I have, uh, let me redo this idea I have. I reach a different voltage. That one has the least amount of wires hooked to it. So I'm thinking that goes there. It's only a 10 amper. Meanwhile, you have, this one only has two wires. Then you have three wires on that one and three on that one. So let's put that one there and that one there. Okay, let's try again. So we'll take the 10 there, 15 there, or I put 20 there and this one here. No, so it's not that, it's not that. It can't be color coded. I already tried that. Like even if it's color coded, this one would go there. Because, well, yeah, uh, 20 would be that one because yeah see that one and then this one there and that one there all right we're about to say i'm gonna brute force this 10 stays there 15 goes there 20 goes there and this one goes there no okay fine 10 goes there this one goes there this one goes there and this one goes there Right. Ten goes there. This one goes there. This one goes there. goes there. Okay, so that is out of the question. This one goes there. This one goes there. Yeah. Say hello to my madness. be a hint for this or I'm just extremely stupid which I would not be shocked there's supposed to be some type of text or something I'm not seeing it it's just the color of the wires you have a green wire which is going in on the fir
That one has to be there. They're all connected to it. Use it on the left side, I'll have numbers on them. 25, 30, and 50. Okay. I need to get. We have a 25. Okay. How do we do it? How do we do it? I'm, I'm, I'm thinking out loud right now. Excuse me. So all of them are going in the out. So I have to get each of these. Okay, 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 okay. I got, I, I'm getting something now. So this one's 25. If it goes there, that one's immediately 25. That one's 50 and that one's 30. But the third one, I need, okay, if I need 30, that one has to be 10. I think we're getting something. Then, um, okay, 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 okay. That one goes to the third one, which is 30, so. Whoops. Give me a second. Let me take the 10 back. 10 has to go there. 15. Uh, okay. Give me a second. 25. 10. I have it now. I have it. I think I have it. Okay, the middle. Middle has to be 50. It has to be 50. What else is going in the middle? 25. 20 and 25. 45. Damn it. No. Not happening. Now, 50. The middle one has to be 50. The 25 cannot be there unless I'm doing 15, then that's 30. Okay, no, okay. Scratch that. Whatever happens, 25 cannot be that. It could be a... And five. I think I might have something like that. It's the same solution. Each box is one of those fuses and you have to add up to the ampage. So the right one is 30. Have to get the 30. If none of these are actually 30. You have to add up to 30. So this one, the top right is by itself occluded and the bottom one now has to be to get the 30 it has to be 20 20 is now going in the middle which then also goes in the bottom left so we need it cannot happen it cannot happen it also goes in the left also listen uh, 25 get that one it's only connected to all of them. Am I doing this wrong? I'm going. second guess yourself yet I'll have a chance okay. reset reset what doesn't help is the first box I just noticed has a bunch of cables a blue a red and a green it has to be 25 I'm thinking here I, I'm very stupid I know That green cable, I think, is the important one. It goes into each of them. 
compared to all the others. Then becomes a red and a right there. What do I want to do with you? So you have to be 30. To be 30, you have to have a 10. You have to have a 20. Then that green one goes on. That one. But then the problem is you do not. 20. Ah. I think I'm thinking of this entirely wrong. Entirely wrong. I see the cords. I'm trying to connect the cords. Those leave go over there to those fuses. This is the first puzzle of the game, and I am stuck on it. That's hilarious. I got it, I swear. I just I actually have to start working my brain. I have to make them all add up. So let's start with the middle. The middle can be... 1525. No. Well, actually... How do I get it? You have two different ones. You have the bottom left and bottom right. That's where you're coming from. Technically, everything I have does not add up to 50. But we also see that the green cable also leaves it and goes into the first slot. Unless that one's 50, that one's Second, do I have anything? Electric key, no. Drawing, Julian Saul's notes. Do not look at that photo. Repair leaks, fist. Uh, Don't want to look at that photo. Wait. Ah! Oh, never mind. I didn't think to be caught up on a puzzle immediately. Oh, it's been so long since I played a puzzle.
Oh, that took quite longer than it needed to be. Max, this should make things easier. Fall down, me. Fall down. EV. Ooh, saliva. <coughs> All right, now we need to do this. Number of street address, or our street address, which they mentioned multiple times at the beginning. So that'd be on one of the letters. Give me a second. Um, no, yes. Nope, not this one. Oh, I remember getting that one letter, but oh, I'm not looking at you. Um, damn. So much for that okay so i'm th i was thinking of the uh letter that i found from the guy who gave the the writer the music box the problem is is it was held by the first character who is missing yay And then we know the painting on the right side, upstairs, I'm looking for a round painting. Not a square, rectangle, rhombus, no, I'm looking for a round oval painting. And then what, what after that? I'm sorry. Um, I'm also looking for Saul's age. I do I don't want to look at you. I wish I didn't look at it. Yeah, I'm not looking at that again. I shouldn't have done that. I knew looking at it was bad. I get creeped out a little easily too, so I'm like, ooh, goosebumps. I'm a wimp, I know. I need clues. I'm missing some clues. I'll uh, look for a round painting. Not that one, not you. It's There's nothing here that is a round painting. leave we've been down here a long time but now the problem is is uh and a lot of these paintings are disturbing okay been a while we're back up here All right, we're gonna have to look in every room. I'm looking for round paintings, notes of age, anything. No. Can't be opened, right? Yeah. Um, garage won't have anything for Yeah, no garage is gonna have something for me. I just remember power's back on. I can open the garage. All right, let's read this real quick. Now it's important. Boiler functioning upper panel. Shut down, press left button, start, press central, emptying, press right. In case of malfunctioning, prevent, preventing correct boiler functioning. You can perform an emergency shutdown by keeping the blue button pressed for four seconds. Mm -hmm. I see that war here is on. Pipes have seen better days. 
there is no blue button, so... Oh wait, this is it. Did I do it? I think I did it. Alright, man, I... I'm sorry if this is a really bad idea. Alright, this is supposed to... Mm -hmm. Battery clamp. Oh, I can use that with the thing upstairs. Usher's car, the battery must have ran, run out. Why is it still here? I should have left a folder in the car. Should I try? <laughs> oh, that's... You can't tempt me and give me a yes and no. I got a feeling that is not good. <clears throat> Here's the thing. If I grab that folder, I'm immediately looking away. Ooh. Why would you give me an option to reach for it? What's going to happen if I put my hand in that car? I can clearly see there's nothing in that car, yet you're giving me the option. Do you want to reach your hand and grab whatever's in that car? It's like, I kind of do, but why are you asking me that? Why are you giving me a choice? I'm going to ignore you for now. Ooh, I want it, but I'm going to ignore you for now. We're doing it. Oh. Oh, God. Okay, I thought something bad was about to happen. A piece of a, cl of a collectible, a blue folder, or several sheets of paper. Alright. Is that it? Must. Right, that's it. So it's a collectible? Alright, we gotta be careful, because even though I'm outside, whatever that evil thing is, it killed the dog. And you're making all that noise. There's a... Yeah, there's the dog house. There's the sand... Nothing more in the sandbox. Ooh, I love those types of benches. They're uncomfortable a little, but they're fine. It's just nothing but newspaper and seating right now. Oh, wait. Shovel. I don't need to dig right now. What you're saying is I'll need to dig later. Wait, where is this going? Nope. Safe to me. Not gonna happen. Need the other half of the key. Um, I can do battery clamps. Also, I'm looking at the screen. I might enlarge my webcam just a little bit for the next one. This one I'm gonna leave it the way it is. It's gonna be weird if I move it now. All right. So the boiler has been shut down. Don't know what that did. Um, I need a key for that. I can't get in there. Um, the only thing I think of is going upstairs and activating that thing for some reason. So let's go upstairs. Sounds good to me. Wrong button. Okay, uh, that door is useless. I want to go up this door. I 
like how there are lights now. The lights are flickering. My question is, will the lights uh, give away the... Uh, location of that thing. Keep walking straight. <laughs> the darkness hiding. Something terrible is drawing near, you need to hide before it's too late. Look around you and find a place where you can go undetected. Once you're, you've interacted with a hiding place, it'll appear on the map the following symbol. I'm sure. I gotta hide here. <laughs> Wait, the darkness, keeping calm. You managed to hide from the darkness, but the worst is yet to come. Try and keep a level head. Calm down, follow the rhythm of your heart by pressing... Okay. Don't let your heart beat too fast or you start to panic. Above all else, don't look at it. Let's go for This horse best fuck all now. Am I doing this right? to learn that one better because that one was weird for me like i was trying to hit with the rhythm and nothing bloody hell what in the world is happening inside this house i don't know but give me a second i don't like that you calm fall the rhythm of your heartbeat yeah i did that and then i was in it for like a minute so you can't die at that one that's great oh i'm running now cool yeah, that was weird. Like, I was hitting it with a heartbeat. I was, but it wouldn't. I don't know. And then I just want, like, you know, hold it. Just gonna keep holding it. I don't know. That was odd. Also, we're in the child's room now. 
Look at this dollhouse. Hmm. So, my dolls are missing. I don't think I've ever seen toys like these. Yeah, it's an ugly toy. I take it safe to go outside because I can't exactly list. Huh? I'll fix that momentarily, maybe. Is that what the headlamp's for? Is this like Alan Wake where if you point light at the darkness, it goes away? All right, here you go. keep that searchlight on the entire time pointing down the hallway that'd be nice yeah i hate to say if we do hiding again i'm probably going to die because that is a very weird mini game all right I deem it safe. Die. Oh. Gold key. Let's say. Rasha. Yeah. Marsha. My bad. Service key, meaning I can go back outside. Where am I? Map. I mean, it's entirely new hallway, Julia. Okay. Looks like an album kids listen to these days. A poster of Alice in Wonderland. I like this kid. A voice recorder of Husher's Children. The label on the cassette reads JNS 14th, 1998. Mommy's really scared. I'm scared too. She's broken all the mirrors in the house. And that song? I hear it everywhere. I wish we'd never listened to it. Something is watching us. This bed's been used in a while. It's probably Julia's. Usher's daughter. Oh, wait. Ooh, I need that. Awesome, awesome. Usher's daughter is into skating. I'm sure she could teach my boy a thing or two. Wardrobe. Okay. It's a hiding spot now. What? What is going on? Okay. Something weird's happening and I don't know what. This game get any more uneasy. I'm waiting for the one that doesn't make noise until like a 
minute in. Damn, it reeks in here. Man, that stinks. Something is really clogging the pipes down there. Um, tongs? <coughs> yep, nope, okay. Black rag doll, dirty rag doll, poor thing is all patched up. Yeah, this is a creepy looking doll, I hate to say. What kind of toy is this filthy thing? No wonder why I ended up in the toilet. What the heck? You broke all the mirrors in the house. Why is it so damn cold? I can't just stand here. I need to move. Okay. Thank God. I think it's over now. We're not going in there. Yeah, uh, there's that door there. Not happening. Mm-mm, mm-mm, I heard that. Oh, must be safe. I'm gonna have a heart attack for the end of this game. Horror is not my forte, though I did really want to play this game. Okay, what do we have? We have a doll. We can now go outside. Wait. We can do the key, too. We can do the key. I a green hue. I don't know. Alright. Okay, give me a second. Combine. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Then use. Nailed it. Give me a second before I open it. I deem it safe. Hello. Ah. Metal hook. I can use that maybe for... I don't know. Third... Oh, another letter. Dear Sebastian, everything is falling apart. I don't know what is happening to my telephone, but I can't seem to reach you, which is why I'm writing this. As I do, I pray it's not too late. Sebastian, do not listen to the music box. I repeat, do not listen to that music box. Something is wrong with that melody. I hear it over and over in my head while I walk, when I read, when I read, while I eat or sleep, everything in my dreams. Things are getting worse and worse. I feel observed, Sebastian. At first, it only happened in my dreams, but lately, I also feel it while I'm awake, although I find it increasingly hard to tell the difference these days. There's something here with me, a strange presence in the halls behind each door I turn my back to. I don't know what is happening to me. I'm so sorry, my dear friend. I cursed the day I sent you that box. Yeah, so he learned he sent his friend basically a death sentence. I take it running will bring it to me, so I'm gonna just walk for now. I have no reason to run. Running makes noise, and I got a feeling I don't want to make noise. Still looking for a round painting. I'm learning to lay out this house slowly. All right. 
one second. Listen. Okay. I deem it safe. No. Hmm. Wrong button. Mm -hmm. Oh, wow. Real notes, half of them are in Russian or some Slavic language. Ah! God, I got it shut. Huh? I now know what the darkness sounds like. What's that? Medication? Sleeping pills? Yeah, no. I'm good. If you're wondering, I was gonna run out that door. He wouldn't let me. Alexander, I wish you never had to find this note. I left the house, or at least I tried. Pray that this is not the last time you hear from me. I haven't seen Miss Catherine or the children in days. Sometimes I hear them crying upstairs, but I never find them. They always seem to be in the room next door, even if such a room doesn't exist. There's something horrendous here with us, something that I can't describe. I barely dare to leave our room anymore. I have to go for it's too late. I love you. Marsha. I should have played him first. An open Bible, half read. There's an unread verse, but it's in Russian. Okay. An orange doll, a rag doll with short ponytail. Hard to tell the nose from the cheeks. Or gold clothes covered. Actually, give me a second. Lyra from Marsha. There's nothing on the back. Okay. Sewing machine. are dirty. I think I even see mold. Yeah. I am. And if I played her husband first, I think that really would have been something. I wonder if when you lose a character, what happens? Like, do you just get picked up with a character? Black and white picture of a young woman. Probably from Eastern Europe. Probably his wife. Question is, are they gone? I'm talking about the darkness. Or is it still behind the door lurking? It's quiet now. It is quiet. Where am I? Let's open this door. Mm hmm. Great. Double check, just to make sure. These sheets are covered in dust. I wonder how long they've been there. Those cans smell like bleach. They must be in the laundry room. I think it's full of black water, I can't even see the bottom. We all know what's in there. Oh. No, 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 no. I don't care if there's a collectible in there, that is death. The car would have made no sense if it killed me. It was open, I could see it. 
That is death. I got a feeling there's insta kills in this game. That is an insta kill. Reach your hand. It's not Silent Hill where you reach your hand in the toilet and get an item. That has to be death. There's no way reaching my hand in black water where I can't see the bomb is safe. I'm not going to do that. Now, what new items have I gotten? I got the dolls. I got two dolls. And I got the hook. Examine. Hmm. Okay, I can get into the ceiling with this. I am not reaching my hand in the bathtub. I don't care if it's telling me to. I don't trust it. Where was the upstairs hatch again? I honestly don't remember. That's the basement. I can't do that. Playroom? Oh, right there. I think that's it. Where's this lead again? Okay. Yeah, I'm not reaching my hand in the, uh... I'm, I'm not doing it. it. It could be another collectible. Fine. Still not doing it. Wait. One will be hungry, so our friends will feed her, feed, make her dinner for her. And I haven't been there yet. Dining room or kitchen? The dolls in the dining room and the kitchen. Don't look at the mirror. I gotta keep my sanity. Under the table. Just get out of here. Okay. So a doll might be here somewhere, so let's see. Okay, I don't see anything. Damn. Probably not yet. Alright, we have to go upstairs. I will do that. Back in the door came from, or I can continue straight. I forgot what it was, oh, it's a hiding spot. Yeah, I don't want to go with it. <laughs> Let's hope I don't end this episode with a death. I don't know. I really do not know. Oh boy. Alright, well, while I'm halfway up the stairs, where am I going? Okay, I know where I'm going. Just walk down the hallway. Don't need to run. We're good. What's up there? It's the painting fourteen, nineteen seventy nine. 
that's the painting I needed. You have to excuse me, I'm gonna take a picture of that on my phone. Just want the day, July 14th, 1978. My bad. No, that's gonna come in useful. I don't have a pen and paper. I've seen that painting before, it makes me nervous. It was painted in 1745. See scaffolding, it's like, probably reach it through one of these windows. No. Do I want to go near her? This one's sinister work of art. Are they all like this in the house? The label says it's from 1942. Or, sorry. I have the date wrong, but I'm very worried. Here's the camera. Here's the damn camera. I don't want to talk to her. Don't make me talk to her. Please don't make me talk to her. Ignore her. Go outside. What did I say? There were gonna be insta kills in this game. Oh my god. That's actually great. <laughs> I didn't. Why did I? Try that. Listen, the chick was easily gonna kill me too. Oh my god. <laughs> yep, I called it. I said I was gonna die. And I don't even think I finished chapter one. That's the funny thing. Oh, and I lost one. Oh. Guess I'm gonna end it here. Uh, next time we'll pick up with a different character. I'm thinking of doing Alexander personally. Yeah, I'm gonna. You know, we'll select the character first, they'll call it. Ah. I was so worried about getting away from that lady. I didn't think, hey, is there anything outside that window I can grab? You just, done. Losing your characters. Sadly, you just lost one of your characters. When this happens, the victim is no longer part of the story. If you lose a character, every item in the inventory will drop to the ground. The location of these items will appear on your map with the following icon. As long as you still have playable characters, your progress in the game will be saved. Be careful, if you lose all of them, you'll have to restart the episode. So, technically, where did I die? Upstairs. Okay. Well, now I'm an old man now, who drinks. Baka always assured me a moment of peace. Everything seemed to go quiet, all the scream, even the screams. Has one use. No. 
Noch. Or. Guess I'm in here. Next time I'm going to try and grab my items. <laughs> Happy horror. And... Spooky Halloween. It's a month of scary games, baby. But until then, I'll see you next time. And bye. God, I can't believe I did that, man. I really can't.